everybody, it's Lurgs here. Welcome to my channel. I'm here to save you time and money. And today it's how to remove the dispenser drawer on an Indesit washing machine. This is so you can take it out, give it a good old clean. You don't want all this gunk and gunge going onto your clothes. Right, let's get cracking. This is the Indesit IWC6105 washing machine here. And while I'm showing you this, there's a link above now about how to install a brand new washing machine. Okay, so to remove the dispenser drawer, just pull it out at the top. Now, some of them do have a button at the top. This one doesn't. What it's got, it's just got two clips, one there on the left-hand side and one here on the right-hand side, just stopping the dispenser drawer from coming out so all you need is a little bit of brute force you kind of have to squeeze it into the right and push it upwards and then that just releases it now this one is pretty dirty full of gunk and gunge so what you can do is just give it a nice good old clean this is a different detergent drawer here from an older washing machine so just take any old toothbrush and just give it a really good clean in hot soapy water inside and outside whilst i'm cleaning this there's a link above now on how to guides for all sorts of makes and models of washing machines there's some really good stuff in there okay before you put the dispensing drawer back in it's definitely worth giving the inside of this drawer a good old clean with a nice soapy cloth don't be tempted to use a toothbrush because it could go down that hole and get stuck in the washing machine now once you've cleaned your drawer and your detergent drawer just slide it in with the grooves and push it all the way home. And there's a link above now about toilets and plumbing how-to guides. Lots of good stuff in there. As a bit of routine maintenance, it's also worth checking the rubber inside the washing machine here. Make sure that drainage hole there is not blocked. And if you've got any gunk or gunge in here, just give that a good clean. And then the next time you have a wash, you know it's going to be super clean and super fresh. And then don't forget to put the toothbrush back of whoever toothbrush you borrowed. If you would like more videos on how to save you time and money, then please press the subscribe button down here. I really do appreciate you visiting my channel, everyone. If you'd like to select any other videos around here, that would be really cool. And be sure to hit that bell notification tab. 